It's a tight squeeze. These German cars are all waiting to be shipped. It's a major logistical challenge, and Jörg Ambrosi has to keep a strict watch. 700 vehicles have just arrived from Daimler. The first train has to be unloaded by 9 because we're working according to a tight schedule. The trains have fixed timetables and have to return to the plant on time. The drivers are always under time pressure. 1.2 million cars pass through here annually, and each one is assigned to a different space. I scan in the vehicle, and the scanner tells me where it's supposed to be parked, and then I get my two check marks outside, and that's it. Avoiding accidents is crucial, especially with the luxury models, though some arrive damaged. Vandalism is a costly problem, requiring constant surveillance by port personnel. Today's damage report includes seven or eight Daimlers and Porsches. The supervisor helps the driver stay calm despite the pressure, but accidents can always happen. No, no, the drivers aren't held responsible, except in the case of gross negligence, as is customary, but otherwise we're insured, of course. The next logistical challenge is loading the big ocean freighters. One ship can accommodate 6,500 cars. From the port of Bremerhaven, all manner of products are shipped across the globe. This is the booming high and heavy business, and it's Peter Krip's area of expertise. He can drive anything, and he's accurate down to the last millimeter. Getting this brand new articulated bus on board is not proving easy. You really have to trust him, right? That's right. But they can handle it. A sense of space and having the right intuition, he says, is essential if the bus bound for Dubai is to arrive unscathed. I just have to watch for his hand signal. How much space do you have? Sometimes it's just 10 centimeters from the side of the ship. Space on board is very valuable. Then the freight has to be secured. A full load is worth around 250 million euros. After several hours, the giant carefully makes its way out of the harbor. Two locks lead from the docks in Bremerhaven out to the open sea, and one, the old Kaiserschleuse, is currently being modernized and is out of commission. This is a mammoth undertaking costing 233 million euros, and it poses a risk during construction work. Any ship blocking the docks could bring business to a standstill. <laughs> 